What's going on guys, it's your boy D, welcome back to another video, and today guys, I am going to go over my personal top 3 things that should be added into Apex Legends. Remember, this is all opinionated, this is not me thinking like it's factual, like it should be in the game, it's just personally my opinion, if it doesn't get added to the game, then it doesn't get added to the game. Let me know down in the comment section below if you have any ideas of what should be added to the game. I'm definitely down to have a conversation with you guys about that. But without further ado guys, let's get right into it. The first thing I believe that should be added into the game is a Gibraltar nerf or a lifeline buff. Now, we've all wanted a Gibraltar nerf. Me personally, I think the biggest problem with Gibraltar is that his arm shield is regenerating while he's taking damage. Hey guys, I don't think I explained this very well in the video, but basically what I'm trying to say is when your arm shield is regenerating and it's still on cooldown and you're in a gunfight, it should stay on cooldown. Now, if it's at 100%, of course, you can bring it up whenever you want, but if it's at 90%, it should stay at 90% when you're taking shots. But if they don't get rid of that, they need to buff Lifeline because Lifeline like under the rug recently all because gibraltar has gotten the resing buff right he, he gibraltar can literally res you faster than lifeline in his bubble you shouldn't be choosing gibraltar for resing over a literal combat medic you know what i'm saying like the combat medic should be the best person at resing so why the heck is gibraltar better at resing so they need to either nerf gibraltar or they need a buff lifeline. We need another aggressive legend. So Octane was really loved when he first came out because of his mobility. He was able to get on top of roofs really easily. He was honestly great when he first came out. Now he's not as crazy as he used to be. He's not as picked as he used to be. Most of the legends that have been posted recently have been really good for ranked, but they're not necessarily perfect or really good for pubs, for playing aggressively and going for high kill games. But anyways guys, on number three, we have character selection animations this one's great i love this one i love this one remember when in the the wraith event when they had she had that new animation with the hemlock comes through the portal with the dang motorcycle mask thing of thing like it was a brand new animation and we need those as cosmetics like we need those as cosmetics if we can get those in packs that'll honestly that'll be a game changer that'll be honestly amazing that'll make the character selections be way more interesting to look at because most of the time when I'm in the character selection I'm on my phone I'm on Twitter I'm on TikTok I'm doing my stuff I'm looking at how my channel's doing or whatever and because there's nothing really to look at there's nothing really to look at unless someone takes my legend and I get hella pissed then yeah I'll look but like other than that I there's really no point of looking at the character selection animation so if they could add those animations some brand new animations for for you to get on cosmetics That'll honestly make character selections way more interesting. Uh, that's all I have for you guys today. My name is Diego. If you're brand new to the channel, please subscribe if you enjoy these kinds of videos. Currently at 752 subscribers. I'm on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave a like. Let me, let me know down in the comment section below how you felt about it. Anyways, guys, I'll catch you guys on the next one. See ya.